Hey Star Wars fans, this is Blitzkrieg Gaming, and I am here with an episode of Star Wars to talk about that same very subject, Star Wars. Now, um, what a, a lot of people, hmm, I should start this off with the teaser trailer. So, as you guys, which I think most of you guys have seen, is the Star Wars teaser trailer. And that trailer contains a lot of things which Star Wars fans love. Like a pod racer, I think. I think that's what she was. Stormtroopers with nice looking helmets. I mean, they look more futuristic. Uh, also, TIE Fighters and very interesting little Easter eggs. Almost. Now, when I mean by Easter egg, I I am talking about like not like well, I think you guys know what Easter eggs are. So one of the Easter eggs that I was looking at was that I don't know if you guys saw at the very end of the teaser trailer. When the Millennium Falcon was banking all the way up just to go down to make that cool nice ending scene. His radar dish was rectangular. Rectangular. In the original movies, it was like a regular circular dish. Now, at the last movie, uh, Han Solo, Han Solo did, uh, Got his uh, uh, the radar dish. I'm sorry, I can't remember you guys. Radar dish. Uh, it was destroyed inside the Death Star. Now, what's probably happened is that Lando's paid him back because he said, "Oh shoot, I'll have to pay him back," or he said something similar to that, or he didn't say anything of that at all. It's just my imagination. But nonetheless, uh. Yes, it is level one. Okay, so uh, back to what I was saying about Star Wars. It looks like it is gonna be the best movie ever. Okay, I wouldn't say the best movie ever, but it looks like it's gonna be pretty decent. And now, when I mean pretty decent, uh, like decent, decent, like it, it doesn't look too bad. Like it looks amazing. That's the type of decent I'm talking about. Um, another thing that I have not learned, sorry. Another thing that I've noticed from the trailer. What, oh shoot, they upgraded their station. See, this is why as an empire, you never want a rebellion. Because this stupid, they fight back. And it's not fun. It's not fun for your economy, bro. Uh, bros and bras. It's it's not fun. Trust me. When you're spending thousands of credits to defeat these people, don't worry. They'll, they'll be done in a minute. <laughs> so as I was saying about the new Star Wars. Well, okay. Uh, uh what was I saying? Oh yes, the new Star Wars. Um. There was a lot of controversy. Uh, I'm hearing a lot of controversy still about there being, and in no way I mean this in offense, a black stormtrooper. I mean, yes, there have been other stormtroopers in the past who weren't clones of Jango Fett due to the fact that the Empire needed soldiers, you know, snap, 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 here and now. But, uh, so... If you guys can see, he's stuck on a planet, most likely tattooing. Don't know what he's doing there, though. I mean, he may have been stranded, just like, just like uh, CPO and R2 were on uh, Tatooine. We you, we never know. But uh, one interesting thing, though, is that new double-bladed sword. That double-bladed sword. Now, a lot of people have been saying, oh, it's going to cut off his finger, <laughs> right? What well, idiot would have a double-bladed lightsaber, a triple-bladed lightsaber, <laughs> and have a, 
uh, and have a, I'm sorry, what was it? And have, what's the word I'm looking for? Cross guard. There we go. Thank you, myself. Uh, to have a cross guard like a lightsaber. Um, cross guards are designed to protect your hand from incoming slashes and dashes. Oh look, well it's going to be the end of the video soon. So, but as I was saying, uh, it doesn't. I believe that whenever they hit them, like when they accidentally cut themselves, that gives them rage, and that gives them anger, and that gives them more power, that gives them more force. That's those are my theories. And the last one I wanted to tell you before I go was that. Maybe when the lightsaber strikes down, if you guys see a lot, uh, whenever people are fighting, when Luke fought Vader, Vader cut off his hand because he went down at an angle and cut it off. Uh, when you see Dooku and Anakin Skywalker in Episode 2, when Dooku was fighting him, he sliced him at an angle, going straight down the lightsaber. Maybe that's what this cross guard is defend against those type of attacks I don't know put what I don't know it could be a lot of different things but I want to say thank you guys for taking the time to watch this comment on what you think uh, of anything I said and I hope you guys have enjoyed this video oh and don't forget to comment on things that I can do better thank you a lot this is Blix Creek signing out